Everybody wants to know when they start drop shipping, which Shopify theme do I recommend? I've got two for you today. I've got a free one and a paid one. And uh, these are the two themes that I've seen work the best this year. Now, many of you guys are familiar with my, my old strategies, my old courses where I'm recommending that you use the turbo theme. And that's not the case anymore, even though I used that theme for about five years. And it was a great theme. But these two themes that we're using right now and that my students are using right now are getting even better results than turbo. So whether you're brand new to drop shipping and you're just trying to figure out where to start, or maybe you've been drop shipping a while, but your conversion rate's low and you're trying to figure out what the problem is. Maybe you even have a hunch that it could be theme related. I just want to reassure you that the theme, the theme does, does matter. matter. Okay. That, you know, that might not be reassuring, but it does matter quite a lot. Even themes that look really great. I've tested some awesome looking themes out there and there was a very noticeable, very obvious conversion rate drop when switching to some of these other better looking themes. Not that the themes I'm going to share with you look bad, but just because something looks nice doesn't necessarily mean it's going to convert well. So without further ado, the first theme I'm going to recommend you guys start with is the free theme and it's called Dawn. It's offered through Shopify. You can actually get it in their theme marketplace because it is offered from Shopify. You actually get tons of great support. So if you ever have any questions or issues setting things up, Shopify support is right there to help you every step of the way. So highly recommend starting with dawn we've scaled stores to 20 30k days with this theme i've had uh plenty of students do 100k months on dawn with virtually like no issues the the only drawback to this theme is the design capabilities the the branding potential is pretty limited it leaves a lot to be desired but as far as the functional aspect of the theme, it works very well. It's extremely fast. If you're just sending traffic directly to a product page, if you're running you know, image ads like, like we do for, for simple image products, then this theme works, works great. It also is very compatible with every app that we recommend. So currency converters, card upsells, that kind of stuff, uh, post-purchase upsells, all these things work and integrate fairly seamlessly with this theme. So Dawn is a great, place to start. So let's say you've got the money, you've got three, 400 bucks and you, you want to invest in a paid theme. I do want to warn you to avoid the temptation of using a cracked or a, a, like a stolen theme. Okay. So people sell these like cracked themes or they give them away for free. It might seem nice to get this like $400 theme for free, but what happens, and I've seen it happen several times just in the last couple of weeks, is people will actually get banned from Shopify. So as soon as Shopify finds out that you're using a cracked theme, it will result in you potentially being banned from the platform forever, which is just not worth it for 400 bucks. Like just use a free theme or fork over the 400 for a paid theme. All right, so the paid theme that I'm gonna to recommend today, guys, that we've been using a lot over the last year that a lot of my students are using is called Impulse. Impulse. I don't get anything for recommending this theme. I'm not an affiliate with them. It's just a theme that works really well. It's like, uh, it's like Dawn on steroids. Like it just has a whole lot more features uh, for customizing the website, customizing the homepage, customizing your collections, making everything look really, really nice and professional. Okay. And, and, and you can do it very easily. It's very easy to navigate. Just, you know, you don't really need anybody's help. You can do it all in about an hour and make it look really, really nice. So Impulse is a great theme, guys. There's other ones out there that people swear by like Shrine. And I've seen stores work well on Shrine, but it's a slightly different strategy. Okay, so that's typically like long form content, which which you can do on Impulse or Dawn with, you know, some page apps like gem pages or whatever. There's no need to necessarily use Shrine for that type of store. So anyways, uh, Dawn and Impulse, in my experience this year, have been the best performing themes. You can't go wrong with either one of them. Highly recommend you check them out. Give them a try. Yeah, take them for a test drive, if you will. You know, this question gets asked all the time, literally every single day in the Discord, what theme should I use? Is it worth getting a paid theme? Yes, it's worth getting a paid theme, but it's not required. Like I said, you can definitely start with a free one and then just upgrade when you have the extra cash to invest in your business. Um, or just go ahead and start with Impulse. If you know that this is, this is the business for you and that you're gonna make this work and you're not gonna give up, then go ahead, spend the 400 bucks on the theme. You won't regret it. It's uh, it is a great investment. 
in your in your drop shipping business. So anyways, I know this is a simple topic that many of you more experienced guys obviously already know, but there's tons of people who are just getting into drop shipping. This, this one's for you. So thanks guys. If you have any questions on this, if you're having uh, any issues deciding, you know, which one to go with or whatever it may be, anything that you're struggling with, click the link in the description for the discord and I'll see you guys in the yard. Thanks.